And if this was such a good idea, why didn't they do it with previous mayors? Mayor Dave Bronson is responding to the assembly seeking to amend municipal code. The changes would prevent the mayor from entering into operational agreements unilaterally. These agreements would have to be approved by the assembly under the proposed code changes. The, the city can't be run by committee. There's one mayor. There's not 13. I'm just not comfortable with this agreement. The proposed municipal code changes are partly motivated by the mayor not seeking assembly approval to enter into an agreement with O'Malley Ice and Sports to operate the Sullivan, Bemboki, and Dempsey Anderson Ice Arenas. This is the same usurpation we saw with the Roger Hickel Company where we were forced to spend millions of dollars for a contract that we never approved. Had I done it over, maybe I would have given them a phone call to say, hey, this is what's been done, but we didn't need their permission. Arguments made by the assembly for why the mayor should have sought assembly approval and feedback from the public, O'Malley would have operating control of the venues for five years with an extension option to add another five years, and if the municipality wanted to terminate the contract, it would have to provide the operator 36 month notice. Oh, I hear the argument that no, this is not a lease. I get that, I've heard it, but it is. You've given the land away. You show me any investor that's want to invest significant capital and effort into a project knowing that you could yank it out for them for your convenience. In the end, the mayor says, in his opinion, the contract is a good one and helps return the Sullivan Arena to Anchorage as a sports venue. And we can't have great big buildings sitting around costing us money and not generating revenue. Steve Kirch, Alaska's News Source.